Okay. Let's give it a moment. Everything is going up. All right. Well, let's hurry up so we don't get more of this delightful copyright music. Next thing, star the love. Uh... Yahoo! Yahoo! I gotta keep on the lookout for. Jess Mess and Free Toad Bandit 86 who followed me while I was offline. Let's go. It's time to tickle. Mm. I'm gonna do these in order because I don't feel like messing with that chest puzzle just yet. Ray is working! So your boyfriend followed me. If he comes online, we'll make sure to thank him. He and a mod from Techno Panda's stream, Jess Mess, uh, followed me while I was offline about 20 hours ago. They're my first non-bot followers in like a week. <laughs> so, uh, I'm feeling especially, uh, especially grateful today. Jeez, the hundred coin on this one is going to be rough. So who on earth is home? Uh. Oh wait. I have depth perception. I'm all like, we're gonna do these in order because I don't want to do the chest. No, no we're not. Bro, what the hell is this camera right now? Where am I trying to go? I can't see it. Lucky me. Twenty-two followers now. Oh, you have to get the sub to well, whatever. Yeah, the sub without if you don't do the sub, it doesn't push the. Um... All right, I don't know if you can hear the garage. Uh, the room I'm streaming from is situated directly over the garage, so touch it. Touch it, touch it, touch it. I swear to God. Please let it not be someone who's gonna come in here and bug the piss out of me. Yes, it's going to be a good time. 
we'll probably just start out in the training area so you can get an understanding of what the weapons all do. And then pick one that you think you like best and then we'll just go fight a couple softball monsters. And test you on like your top three that you liked. Oh, okay. Yeah, maybe the garage door just feels loud because I'm sitting here next to it, or above it. You used to be able to go look out the window at the garage, but there's so much crap piled up in front of it now. Don't get sucked in, Mario. It's 12.35, who on earth would be home? No, hold on. Oh, I'm too curious. Let me try to lean over this mess and see. It is me, Madre. Oh, she will probably come in for at least a moment. Let's go. Uh, well. I guess at this point, I kind of have to board Bowser, so. Yeah, my mom started work at like 4 o'clock this morning, so odds are pretty good she's not going to bother coming up bothering us or anything, she'll just take a nap. If she wants to come say hi, it's fine, I just... It's been an unorthodox day, I'll sh uh, I guess I'll say. Dude. Oh, I did find out. I'm not the only person who feels like controls for this one are jank. Uh, both of my brothers felt like the controls for some reason weren't as tight as they remembered. And then one had verified that there was actually a bit of a like a minor update updated or different otherwise different Mario 64 which is what this is also our star count is super nice let's get let's get back in there before it plays the part of the castle theme that keeps getting me banged on YouTube yeah, turns out I'm not the only one who feels like it feels like the uh, controls in this one are, are janky and weird. Which is really nice to hear. <laughs> it's really nice to hear. Ba -na 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 -na. 70 stars, the mystery of the endless stairs is solved. And as Bowser said, I can fight the final boss before I even fought the second boss. Just jumped over the second boss. Let's keep going. Ba -ba 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 -ba. But don't don't take this polls thing too seriously, okay? We're not we're not shaming anyone here. Sometimes you just gotta do work. Sex workers valid work, support your local sex workers. Support sex work, period. I want to know what's in this. Nothing is in that. Amazing. Mario and Betty. 
Don't go in the water spout. Yeah, the camera is... Like, I remembered it being not the best. But I didn't remember it being quite this terrible. Well, regardless, I need to grab as many of these coins as I can out here. And then all eight red coins. We'll grab those on our way through to the sub. There should be more on the floor here. There should be more. Oh, there's vertical columns of, oh, over there. Oh shit! No, no, no. Oh, of course, it's right here on top of the waterfall, which I'm swimming towards. Dang it. It's not boss time yet. Let's go. Let's go. Uh -huh. <laughs> Come on, there we go. Alright, now, put it on the floor over here. Let's actually just go ahead and make a whole lap around in case there's more. Go. This ring. All right, proceeding on. I had the thought the other day, since this, uh, the outside zone of this place has, um, the red, uh, rather the white tile, then is this like Peach's bathroom? Like, is this the bathroom part of the castle? My swimming and royal toilet water. Do any of these have special coins inside? They don't. So I seem to recall the sub leaving. And, uh... That giant Bowser face metal over there opening up. Oh. 
That's the way. Pull jumping for red coins. Ah. So it says pull jumping for red coins? Where are the pulls? I feel like something weird happened. No, this sub should definitely have left. Oh, I I know what's wrong. I know what's wrong. Okay, okay. Gather a ton of coins for nothing, but we can practice for later. So the sub leaves after you defeat Bowser outside. That's that's the detail that I'm missing. And that's why the red holes aren't there also. I don't know why I expected it to begin sinking, but Does it make this up if this is the toilet? Uh, some questions are better off if you don't. Think about them too hard. Also, why did he not swim through that grate? He should... He should be transparent and go through the gate. Or the grate. two will be the red coin and the... really felt like this music is super epic. <laughs> Frankly, if they're gonna be this... Like, I'm, I'm frankly surprised there's not even... Oh, shit! There's not even more copyrighted music that YouTube is trying to kill me over than just that slice of the freaking Mario main theme that plays in, out in the castle. I guess I should be grateful. What the heck? Coins. it's underneath there. I had a feeling. I thought I remembered. The prettiest little heart here. He started pressed right or left. He started spinning that way, and then I pressed the other way to make him spin the correct way, and then he just got down. I don't understand. Well, whatever. This is why I'm frustrated. Like, I feel very much like this isn't the game I grew up enjoying so much. 
so now it's a frankly the game has become more of a frustrating chore than a fun and cool thing to do with you guys so I kind of just want to finish it this week whatever the cost may be even if it means super late after hours no mic streams because the house is asleep Boo! No on hold. Well, yeah, the United States Postal Service has not updated me on a package that I was expecting four days ago in three days. So... Uh, all the woes. Mamma mia! Oh, fuck. It's playing... Oh, that's probably a grumpiness on YouTube later. So when I think about these three games that are on this collection, uh, 64, Sunshine, and Galaxy, I always think of this one as being the one that had the best controls, like, the ones that felt the best to move Mario around in, like, going from World, which I'll return to, to this, it took Mario from moving to schmoving, like, it was so much cooler. Oh, I'm sorry you're crying. But like... I don't know. And then they took away like half his acrobatics in Sunshine to make space for Flood. Which was fine. But at the same time, it's like... Dude, like all the fun was in... Flip kicking and all this fun, goofy stuff, like, I was saving 64 deliberately for last on this collection, because by Galaxy, like, they've taken away almost all of his acrobatics and it's just zipping around with the motion controls or whatever, it's like, this was the movement that felt the best, even though the camera got better in later games. Uh, this was this was the game like this is my favorite Mario by far and playing it in this collection has just not been what I expected it to be like if I would have known it would be like this I probably would have played this one second and sunshine last because frankly I had a better time at moments controlling sunshine than this. You did. 
Dreams Land, thank you. The faster you spin it, the more health it gives you. Bro. Get up there, nerd. There's the last one. In what universe is... Thank you. Get up! That's why I remember having to go up there. Get up! Let go of that one. There you go. Okay. Look at a phone call. I could get off calls. Uh, hold soon. More courage, you bet. The love of everything. Wait, what? Whatever. Full health is for suckers. Can't you see I'm having a merry little time making mischief with my minions? Now return the stars! These troops in the walls need him, y'all. What the what the cheese, Mario? Nailed it. Shot again? I thought it took more than one. Come to the top of the tower for the precious princess. Don't... You do be tired though. Mama Mia! Alright, now. No. Yes. Now we can tickle for the final time. In this stage. But not for the final time today. Here, please. Thank you. There we go. Now this ring of coins. Please don't go near that thing, Mario. If you behave yourself, you'll get red Luigi. Make me grumpy, and I forget my stupid joke. The joke could be for the title. It can belong just to there. Text only joke. Mm. Boop. 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 Turn. Metal coins give you water or air to breathe while in the water. Ice cup gives you water to breathe while in the air. Okay, and now this sub is gone, so now this string of coins is dangerous. It will suck you out into the moat. 
Come on now, come on now, come on now, Mario. All over the top of it. You can do it. You can do it. You can do it. There we go. Now get away from here. Let's not get sucked into the boat. I feel like that's the bad thing. Sun's gone. Bulls exist. Jump out. Wait, crap. There we go. Oh, I don't have to ground pound it. You know what I ought to do? Now I'm thinking about it. Maybe tomorrow I'll have my brother set a cow up on one of his computers at his house to lurk the stream. Unfortunately, he's not work. I just need like 22 more followers. And then I need uh, like another like half an average viewer. And I'll be affiliate. Got the stream time. Just need the viewership. Yeah. It's frustrating. Oh. Come on now, I know you can do it. You did it a minute ago. Here you go. Good job. We made. What the? Ugh. I can push buttons in the proper order. If you've seen me play fighting games, you know this. I don't to ramp right there, but I want to do it like this. Please and thank you. Thank you. spend about half of it traveling and then the other half with friends saturdays with my family so friday i'm thinking of doing the birthday stream
No, you're fine, you're fine. Do you feel better? Is it subsided? Are you are you alright now? feel really bad in, like, in what way? Like, you're still panicking, or... Where the hell are the other seven coins? Like, what do you mean you feel bad? Oh, only seven coins. Did I miss seven coins? They're not up here. Those are stuffed up teeth hurt and feel stupid. Okay. Well, I can't really help you with the rest of that, but why do you feel stupid? It's okay if you have a panic attack and hear those other seven points. Well, you're like, not okay necessarily, but like, you're not stupid because you have one. Sometimes things happen. Okay. been over this a few times offline like it's nothing to be ashamed of that you cry a lot or that you feel your emotions very strongly and it's not your fault for having an anxiety disorder like i know you've been through it and i know you hate it and i know it's probably always gonna bother you and there's only so much me talking to you about it is going to help. But... Alright, upstairs now. Mm -hmm. I feel like even if I muted this music on the TV, it wouldn't prevent the dang copyright goblins from coming after my ass. Don't be sorry, it's not something that needs an apology. Yahoo! Like, yeah, I am. And I don't know if that would draw it enough, but... Hey man, I'm good. But if not this though. I just finished cleaning up Bowser's sub and the second Bowser fight. So now we're on the second floor.
I just jumped into the first painting I saw. I'm doing everything all out of order. As a dude. Encoder's having a time? What do you mean? Is it glitchy? Is it buggy? The heck? Hold on, I'm getting a phone call. Your vehicle's warranty! Like, yeah, which explains why you're on a... Oh, okay. You know, I wouldn't even... Honestly, I wouldn't even know where to check for dropped frames on this, honestly. I got it. It's a uh, Streamlabs OBS. So I don't know if that bears it down. Bottom left. Open performance window. Screen quality is good. 7.7% 7 .7 drop frames. Okay. Interesting. Okay. All right, well, it's here now. Let's tickle. Let's tickle. All right. Ugh, I gotta go over there. Is this is a button again. I don't even remember this button. Frankly, there's probably an easier way to do this. Cause it's like up there where that guy is. Like I think that orange box there. Camera, please. I think that orange box up there. Yeah, there we go. You can kind of see it. That's where the star is. I seem to recall there being like a way where you just raise the water to a certain level and then just go there and it doesn't matter anyway. You don't even need all that because you can unless if you can long jump and get burned by fire. Anyway. So much for that. Oh the new internet should do you pretty good. You'd be astonished with a solid connection can get you. Which I am almost the complete opposite end of the house with my Wi Fi. It's probably a small miracle that I'm doing as well as I am. What was this? Top of the town. So, in, I got to find the cannon and launch myself into that cage. Where did you go, Pink Bob Bomb? I know you're here somewhere. I'm just gonna throw myself on the water. It's global warming. It's warm enough to go swimming out here. Nope, I'm at that angle. I'm up here. No! Man, I'm telling you. bothering with this. Turn it up. Nope. I'm gonna just take this ramp. Oop, up the hill. Alright, pink bomb bomb. Where are you? You're probably up there somewhere. It's 
push this. Push. Thank you. Aha. No god. Yo, I'm not trying to rehash Kim Bob on with you just yet. You can go chill out. Snigger snig. Snigger snig. Man, I'm telling you. Yeah, I'll just ignore that. You didn't see that. We're starting from the ramp for the first time in this room. Wait, is the pink pop on out on the thing over here? Is the hold on? I think the cannon is what's down there. Uh, my memory is no good suddenly. I said guess myself. Please. Thank you. Get out of here! I swear to God, don't touch me! Yeah. You know what? Get dunked on. It caused me too much anxiety. Paying bills? Good. Responsibility. That's what we like to see. Okay, yeah, that is the... Actually, watch the pink bob on be over there near the cannon. And I'm remembering something else. Let's go check the over there by the cannon. I swear. Just need pink bob on. Which is weird to me, in like side games, they've added the King bob -omb as playable. And stuff like uh, Mario Kart. Or Mario Party, things like that. But never the Pink bob -omb. But you can play as a Dry Bones. Here's the cannon. He's over there! I don't think there's a way to raise the water higher, is there? I don't think so. Well, he's certainly higher than I can get to. Please? Yeah, just crawl off into the water. That's fine. That's yeah. just fine. There must be a way to raise the water level even higher. This is probably up where I was going before. But at least I found Pink Bob Rum. Dude! No one said do that. If it's anywhere, it must be on that platform, right? The way to raise the water high? I wish this camera would cooperate more. I guess this is a way to do it. not a way to raise it higher. It's, okay. it's up as high as it's gonna get. We'll just, we'll just take that. Here we, go. we accept it. Oh, that was the... I thought it was in the... Uh.
Secrets in the shallows of the sky. Amazing. So, inside of that cave over there, there is a tunnel out to an actual town. And so when it said to the top of the town, of course that's what I thought it meant. Now I find secrets. What is this here for? No, oh, hopefully I didn't need it. Um... This is one... He caught on. Oh, you pass things to play that are more on theme for October. Mermaid's thing is chapter 20. Nice, dude. Well, you went really hard on Rich Witch for like a couple months, so I guess it's fine if you don't have to, if you don't return to it right away. Bro. Amazing. None of these were a secret. Actually, that orange box there might be it. Yeah, so, May, April, June, yeah. And I assume you have released all of that on Kindle Villa yet, so I can only really assume there's more to be released. And you can, in fact, take it somewhat easy. And we really schedule. Yeah, that's true. Yeah, you want to pace yourself so you don't run out of stuff, but you're also not burning yourself out. not the secret. Okay. That's not bad. What to do? Pass the red coin ring or find a secret point. The course red number appears. Okay. Thanks for... Thanks for that, I suppose. Did I hit that orange box earlier? Was it a secret? Was not. Thank <laughs> you. 
I'm so certain I found the fifth secret in an earlier earlier visit. Technically ten. Okay. What? What? I feel like the answer is to keep pushing this box, but maybe. Yeah, you're right. I can't. I can't believe a. Well, I guess maybe I can believe. Like a big company like Amazon would botch something like an e, like a new e-reader monetization method rollout. Jump up there. At least he was courteous enough to just throw me over here. My turn. Jeez, at this point I might as well open the cannon and try for the 100 coin star. This isn't the, this isn't the way? You sure? Oh, 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 I think I know. Can't jump that high. I think I have the concept. Why am I going this way? This makes sense. Come this way. Mario. Dude! I'm just gonna let it run up. Everyone's sick lately. Max and ICPJ just got over theirs. I kind of have been feeling sore throat, but not really. Yeah, 40 coins from the. Good, but once you. I'd have to go into the, the little town area. Good job, Mom. Yeah, I kind of have been too. Which kind of makes me feel like it's just... Like it's just uh, allergies. Being back here in Georgia. Especially because it's not cold here at all. So we still got all the, the famous pollen and nonsense. And then don't nobody ever fuck with the room that I'm staying in, so you know why would they? So it's a little dusty, which is not a problem. I don't think there was anything up there besides a star. I need to lower the water level. Hey Max. Yeah, I I remember that. Did Laura did Laura get it? Oh welcome back. Yeah, yeah. Oh, oh, did you make Mythic last night? Okay, yeah, because I remember hearing about you and you and ICPJ. This is up on YouTube. Oh, are you making your mythic? Because I saw the... It's not enough. 
Your new deck uh, completely kicks ass, by the way. It's so much fun, and it's so cool. Those you can't kill. I didn't get up here, did I? Yeah, I did. Who are you? You think it would just keep circling around, but it doesn't. It makes you drag the camera. And I sincerely don't understand the concept. I gotta figure out how to get up there to him. Because, like... Shit. Oh, I think my max damage backpack is on its way finally. Someday, I'll have devs in my Twitch stream and blowing people up on Twitter about playing their game. Not today. So playing Mario, Nintendo don't give a fuck. Pronto? I don't even remember where he spawned. Of course he fell off there. Like there's this, and then it's like, well what's the point of this? Like you can't get up anywhere from here. I actually haven't. I like I've already got 
So, let's start from the start. Uh, Eyes of the Fox, who's occasionally present in the stream, has begun uh, to make some progress on the branding for my channel. So when he completes that work, I have got a game picked out already to play as like a celebration of that. And it's in, frankly, it's in early access. Like kind of an alpha stage of the game, but it feels really good to play and control. And it's fairly complete. So, it could be possible, however unlikely, that they would be on on that day, like, observing on Twitch, and then come and be like, Hey! You're playing our game, that's super cool! But we'll see. Like, I've seen devs drop into random, like, low and mid-tier streams, especially if they're indie, you go like, Hey, how do you like it? Tell us all about your experiences so far, and things like that, so... I'm very excited. Um, also, Friday, I'm gonna play a non- Red Luigi game on Switch for my birthday. I mean, yeah, maybe. Are you serious? Actually, I feel like the answer to getting up there was when I jumped in the painting at like the top of the painting and then the water level was somewhat higher than is ordinary. But we'll see. I got uh I got a, I got a new game. Uh my birthday that I'm gonna play for my birthday stream. And then it sounds like uh, playing that for your pre-reader is your is your move for returning to stream. Oh hey! Thank you for preparing the candle for me. Also, speaking of Ode, if you're still interested in Super Metroid and Link to the Past rando co-op, I need to get Parsec installed on one or both of my computer machines. I did that way wrong. Um, so it's not like you need to coordinate with your peer reader and figure out when they're going to be in here. So my mom is upstairs. You may hear her talking to my little brother down the hall. You may hear Sigurd, Sigurd sneezing. Otherwise, like, just what do you want to play? Let's start there. I remember Jones posted about how they did the Parsec handoff in somewhere in his Discord. So I'll go spelunking for that later and make some notes. I don't remember this shot being this difficult to line up before, but I probably also just remembered it straight up. I had wanted to play Link to the Past vanilla first, but if you're handling that end of the randomizer, it doesn't matter. 
I think I'll just play Link to the Past another time. Now, this zone should have its own water control switches. I just need to remember where they are. Yeah, cage two rando is a is a good time. Like Civ, you play a lot of Civ. Yeah, I mean, it kind of is like like Metroid on its own has its own unique challenges. That can be difficult or frustrating for a fresh player, even if like even if that player is good at those sorts of games. So playing it randomized first would not be and since I have played Metroid vanilla style. There it is. I would be more than happy to handle that end of the game. I don't remember what that switch is for. I think it has to do with the blue hat? You have the blue hat into there. Which part on earth? Yeah, it's here. You can't just... you can't just... Yeah. You have to wall kick off this, I believe, to get up on top. Yeah. So we have to wait for the hat to expire. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh. Bro, you're there. You're there. I was foolish. Please. Get up there! Get up there, bro! I'm over here! I believe! There we go. Alright. <laughs> Darkest Dungeon actually wouldn't be a bad shout for... Like, returning to stream in October. Since you were mentioning that earlier. I don't know if I'm gonna try to do... Oh my god, it's October spook stream time. Like, I might just carry on as I do. Here we go! Get in there. Ba -da -ba -ba -da -ba. But yeah, see how these reference the town? But then that one before also referenced the town? That's what I mean when I was confused earlier. For those of you who are here for my confusion. Do I even have any spooky games? Potentially. Let's take a quick look. Team, come here. What is this? Unread notifications. Skipped frames. 26% of the last two minutes. Okay. So it is Angie. I have no shortage of games that I want to play. It's the true challenge is motivating myself to play them over games that I'm already familiar and comfy with. Like, for instance, when I was like coming up on like 
1400 freaking hours of Monster Hunter World and going to myself, you know, I really should finish Dragon Ball Xenoverse 2. Which I would dearly love to play. And finish. And then it's like, if I, you know, the Rathalos is it gonna kill itself? Like, you know? <laughs> yeah, you kind of have to let yourself be bad. Uh... Yeah, and honestly, it's it ends up being entertaining, like, all that stuff. Like, that's why, like, guys, like, like, big name dudes, like, XQC kid, like, rage out and, like, stomp the edge of their desk to death and have, like, 2,000 people watching them. It's like, and also, being frustrated is part of the experience and that's okay. You're allowed to have your human emotions on your human stream. Get bored and don't play. <laughs> Some games uh, can become a chore like that. I understand. Like Mario Galaxy, I stared down the barrel of that for like three months. I did not want to touch it. I didn't want to go near it. I didn't want anything to do with it. I was so frustrated at the motion controls. Alright, so, let's uh, theme login. Yeah, which, as we know from our, our other mutual community, uh, feeling sad is also allowed. There's a, um, a streamer that I tune into from time to time, uh, who the first time I saw her stream, like, she was, like, it was like five minutes after the raid I had, I had been a part of that joined and she had, like, a panic attack and was scared she had offended someone in the chat and just cried her eyes out for, like, ten minutes over like a little a little little thing that the person she had been speaking to didn't even he didn't realize that what she had said was a thing that could be construed in like a way that might hurt someone's feelings but it was a really genuine moment and she let herself have that moment on her stream in front of her viewership and accepted it and it happened, and rather than feel embarrassed about it, or self-conscious, she dried her tears and went back to playing Zelda. After she was done, and her whole chat was super supportive and really sweet. And so, I just kind of feel like... I'm gonna have my moments where I'm gonna be mad on here, I'm gonna be frustrated, like God only knows it yesterday was that day so yeah it's, it's okay feel your feel your human emotions you're a human yeah yeah restarts can be rough yeah <laughs> Alright, so, yeah, sometimes you, you throw yourself down the rabbit hole, and that's okay. So let's see, as far as, like, spoken games for October times, I would be more than happy to replay Bloodstained. I could play Bayonetta isn't strictly horror, but it's got monsters. Uh, I have this game called Crawl, which I think is creepy, question mark. But it was like an early, early access the last time I played it. I didn't understand what was going on. 
uh, Dark Souls games are ever popular and have lots of creepy horror vibes. I have one called Enemy Mind, which is a side-scrolling shooter, and it's sci-fi, but it has elements that can be horror. If you tilt your head and squint. Uh, the Hellblade. I would not want to play Hellblade on stream, though. Honestly, it just it's rough. It is a thing. Uh, though I highly recommend it to literally everyone in the universe. Um, blah, 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 blah. what else? Hollow Knight isn't horror strictly speaking, but it is depressing. It's got monsters. Um, blah. Mark of the Ninja, depending on how you feel about it. Because you're definitely scaring the shit out of the people in that game. Uh, I have a like a visual novel style game called Necro Barista, which is about dead people. So that can be tangentially spook a spoken game. Mm. Otherwise, otherwise. Uh... I don't think I have anything else spoken on here. I do not. Yes, MD, you're 100% on board with my brainwave. All right, let's hit up the old wish list because there's still time for me to buy games before October. What's spoken game in here? I'm sure, I must have something. Control it has creeping horror elements inside. Carrion. In which you are the Eldritch Horror. Oh, Devil May Cry? Question mark. Catherine? Question mark. Actually, Catherine might be too sexy for Twitch. The Return of Obra Dinn? Question mark. Mm. And. I think that's it. Depending on how you feel about Final Fantasy thirteen. <laughs> but no, that's it, that's it. Yeah, it might be I mean, I don't know, man. Like I never got all the way through Catherine. Well, I mean, yeah, you know, like it's one thing to sit here and like wiggle my eyebrows and be like, if you know what I mean, but like and like panda guys them out the chat, but I'm not sure how far Catherine's going to go in depicting its sexiness. Anyway, it's not the point. What is the point? The point is the red coin won't collect themselves. Ugh. I think if I was going to play... Uh, how many have I got? Three left? I think if I was going to play... Uh, an allegedly creepy game. Yeah. Mario's gonna backflip! Yeah. Bro, I'm not begging you. Come on, backflip. Yeah. Just, there you go, you did. I knew you had it in you. Uh, of the ones, all the ones that I read off, I think Carrion is the one I would most play. Yeah. Or would most want to play, because it's... One, I've never played it. Two, it's on my eternal list of... Backlog. So it is. It is due. Can I get up there? Oh, I know how to get up there. It has a category on Twitch. Oh yeah, that's right. You got. You probably got gifted a sub in Panda's birthday extravaganza last night, so now you can Panda guys. Alright, it's there. Alright, I guess Catherine's on the table then. Which is also in the in the eternal ceaseless backlog. Mario, I swear to f Man! Hades for Halloween? Yeah, Hades is fine. 
for trying to spoken game. Alright, wet dry world on this board? the heck comes before wet dry world? It's probably snow area. We're not going to snow area, we're going to tiny big land. Doom 64 in red. Like, I really don't hate Hades as much as people want to say that I hate Hades. Like, it just is not my speed. It's not random enough for being roguelike for me. I found the protagonist to be a completely unlikable douchebag. Like, just, Jesus, what the hell? Be right back, guys. gonna call the pharmacy uh wait what is the pluck the piranha flower what piranha flower this piranha flower yeah like it just it very much was not my speed. It wasn't random enough. I did not. I know everyone's like, Zagreus is my beautiful, perfect son. Zagreus was a complete dickhead. For as long as I could bear to watch it. The game cycle was. Uh, I don't know. Didn't really appreciate it. Saw too much of the previous games in it to really want to give it another shot. Um, I have no idea what I'm trying to do. Um, it just, it just wasn't my thing, but then other people went and blew it completely out of proportion, and uh, because of those people, I actually kind of do legit hate Hades. Like, not for anything necessarily to do with the game itself, but rather for the absolutely bizarre everything that happened around it. Like, I remember the first time I saw someone complete a run like get get all the way out of it i remember seeing the, what was unfolding there and going like that's it literal days of effort for that and then it's like oh yeah by the way back in the loop you go like no, get out of my face fuck all the way off like it was not enough for the effort that i had seen put in like if i would have played it to that point like put in all the effort that that player did to get that for my reward on first clear, I would I would have uninstalled the game. Like, just straight up. Yeah. And then like, oh guys, like, it's not the same as the old games. It's like you've got weak attack, strong attack, uh, a ranged attack that takes a retrievable or otherwise regenerative uh style of ammo you have a combat evasion slash movement option and then you spend various kinds of currency to level up yourself and all your weapons like it's it's the same shit they've been making just now it's rogue light rather than like optional rpg turn-based system or straight up uh action adventure like just like y'all Yeah, yeah, exactly, exactly. Like, and honestly, like, I thought I was friends with the one individual who was just going that hard on my face, and I was like, who are you right now? Like, like you're always talking about, oh, it's okay, people don't like what they don't like, blah, 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 but I don't like this, and now you're coming at me sideways about it. Like... I don't own that. In fact, I don't think I've even heard of it. Are you, are you the piranha plant I'm supposed to pluck? I literally don't know what I'm trying to do right now, y'all. 
They hurt each other, that's fine. Mm, oh, okay, okay. I think I remember it now. Well, I did it. Wait, there's more power? Is this the okay? Maybe pluck the piranha plants would have been a, a better a better title. Hey, Lost Play, how you doing, man? We are going for the 100%, clearing out the second floor, Princess's Castle. So far, the stream we have done Bowser's sub. That's zone whatever that was called second bowser fight and now we're in uh we did the the water stage a wet dry world and now we're in big little world i can long jump Koopa the quick should be over here and we race him up to the top of the thing how you doing today on this fantastical tuesday is the toilet seat. Because it was all like white tile and everything. It was like, what do you mean it's not? This isn't vaguely toiletish. Oh my god! And that makes me anxious every time because, like, one time the wind cut out and just dumped us into the hole. Alright, where are. Hold on, is he up at the top and we race down the mountain? I misremembered. The fuck was what sound? Oh, that was the follow alert. Thank you, Lost Play, for the follow. <laughs> it should have also played a gif. I don't know if it's if it's gifing properly. Let's try it out. Replay! Well, my alerts are not operating on my end, but yeah. It should play a, a quick clip of Sonic and Metal Sonic Racing and do the spin dash sound. But I'm not seeing it on my alert box might have to go up higher. In the in the sources chain. Anyway, we'll worry about it later. Thank you for the follow, Lost Play. It's good to have you here. <laughs> Bob. Yeah, it, it definitely is, because the alert box is above the has been above the switch. It's currently highlighted. Here, we can try it one more time. Yep. Okay, there it goes. Now it's above the thing. Wow, it's kinda huge, isn't it? It's okay, we can have it be. That way I won't miss it because I'm blind and deaf. I didn't hear it, but I did see it. So that's fine. Oh, I know I didn't hear it. It's a computer sound, and my computer is currently muted. That's why. Alright, man. Have a good lay down. I hope you feel better. Remember that the cold is weak to fire damage. And water damage. I know you're up here somewhere. 
Oh, if you come in here is uh, on the small on the small island, he's up here as a regular Koopa Troopa, and you can kill him. Whoo! Ducked him. Actually, it might be best if I kill him, so he can't get in the way of me trying to race here momentarily. He should be up here somewhere, I thought. Yes? No? Earth are you, Earth? Gotta love that bomb on battlefield. Actually, I might have run right by him. Perhaps he is here? He's not here. Well, anyway, let's just start from the beginning. Hmm, speaking of emotes, all I've got is my better Twitch TV stuff right now, which is all just borrowed off other channels, like my favorites from them. I need to get some of the max damage ones added in. I never remember. Boo! Boo! Get out of the way! There we go. Amazing. That has never happened before to me ever once in the entire history of me playing Mario 64. Mamma mia. Alright, honestly, my guy, where'd you go? So I thought he was a, up near the peak of the mountain. Also, I think I got up there to that island with the post on it, like, one time. Definitely over here somewhere. Actually, okay. Fair enough, game. I have depth perception. I don't know how far away I am from something. Bro, go back to being a cameraman. <laughs> Super Mario World. Fish eats you. Yeah. 
I'm actually starting to be a little low-key nervous that, like, he's, like, over here somewhere else random, I don't know where. So you'd think I'd have found him by now. Play the finish line. I ain't here. What? But the mm, homeboy. Mamma mia! Uh, you can ration it to them. Why oh, they don't eat it all at once? Thank you. Let's see. So, I'm sitting here thinking pretty much the only people who would need to know are President Probably no stream tomorrow. I gotta teach Boo Nanners how to Monster Hunter Rise. And they have not consented to being on stream for that. And then after that, I gotta go look after my nephews. Which, I can't hook up my stream nonsense at their house. So then, that's Wednesday. Thursday we'll probably stream. And then Friday definitely stream. But then Saturday through Tuesday no stream. Because family and friends time. So I will probably maybe guest star on the max damage stream. He chooses to go live while I'm present. No! That's on me. Missed half of that. Okay. Tomorrow, no stream, because you and I are playing games. And then I gotta go look after my nephews. Day after more of this, assuming I don't beat it tonight, which I doubt. Um, Friday, birthday st uh, stream stuff. And then Saturday through Tuesday, no. Because they're going to be with Max. But maybe I will be on a Max stream if he chooses to stream while I'm visiting. We'll figure it out. We'll see. Did you hear it that time? Okay, good. Yeah, well, you're back here somewhere. I know you're not in big mode because I've killed you in big mode. Dude! What is this? Back here. Mm -hmm. 
Long time no see. You got fast. You've been training with Slyers. Star power. It's probably star power. You're feeling down about losing the last one. Rematch. You about to lose, son? A foot race Sonic the Hedgehog every four years at the Olympics. You ain't got shit on me. Oh, thank God. I need it. You lose! You spent all your savings on Bakwa and Sprint shoes. She got faster shoes. She gone for that Mach 5 like Speed Racer. It's a stupid rat. Look, he's just trying to feed his turtle sons. And you didn't put out any pizza. I love how Koopa the Quick is basically like the granddad of the free running Koopas in Odyssey. Five itty bitty secrets. I means be big Mario. So let's go find a pipe and change to big Mario. Shweem. Sweet. Turn left. Dodge. Weave. Oof. I'm gonna go out with the fan around 5, 5.30 today. That's gonna be a good time. Then later tonight. What the fuck? Us. Mm. Later tonight. Uh, let's just start here. Ba -da -ba 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 -ba. Let's go. You want to leave me alone? Incredible. Jump out of the water! Thank you. Hit the orange box! That wasn't a secret at all. Nailed it. Get dunked on. Can I even go this way? Oh, look at that. I wonder if this has anything to do with the secrets. It does not. And now I'm gonna get stuck out here. No, just fall on the just fall on the thing. Oh, okay. Mamma mia. Uh, I think that's gonna be no no no, because after I hit that switch I can I should be able to jump back up there. Okay. Okay, I got it. Come in there, fine. Yeah, it'll be fine. Wee, wee. No, bro. Oh, okay. No, what are you doing? Here you go. How they all breathe fire out here? The ones on the ground floor didn't breathe fire. Cheap nasty game, I'm telling you. Jump over it. This one. Bro! It's fine. It's fine. Quit sliding! Please. That's not one. That's two. Do I just gotta touch five holes? Don't answer that. It's not the way it sounds. Four. 
fuck do this? Top two. It's not hard. Maybe it is. Thank you for not running off the world. No! What did I just say? I just thanked him for not doing the thing, and then he didn't. He went and did the did it, y'all. Y'all, he did it. He did. It. I love how they're too small to damage you. Turn the camera! It's a turn the camera! Let's tickle. Telling you, bro. Come on, bro. Please, bro. Gently, we'll slide off it. What did I just say, uh, nerd? Mm. I don't know what I'm talking about. There's no reason to pay attention to it. Why would you ever do that? It doesn't make any sense. There's no reason for it. <laughs> I don't even care. I don't even care. Ba 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 ba. Oh yeah, I just figured out why. I... Now we we should see better frame rates and things now. I forgot that YouTube was trying to mute the freaking Mario theme song on the last stream archive in the background. It's been running since nine o'clock this morning. And it hasn't even tried to finish yet. Just close it. Start it again to nine. So that's one. Can't believe I actually got on the platform. Get down! Thank you. Thank you! Put a little beetle on. Now it's out on that. Remember where it was earlier, y'all? That's where we gotta go. Please turn on the cannon! The only question left to me is, can I reach over there? No! Mamma mia! Does he grabbed the ledge. Behold the tiny miracle. Bro! 
Be like that. See if I can. I don't care. It's a tall order. It's a big ask, and you're a big model. But, bro, if we can just. If we can just get these five. These five little cigarettes, and then get a Starbucks. I promise it's not that difficult. I know you can do it. I believe. I believe in you! Beagle Mario. Man, I know I can. It's him, Mario. Mario's the doubter here, not me. last time. No! Fuck them! Y'all, I was gonna... I was gonna crouch and backflip up there, and then he grabbed the ledge, and my crouch turned into a let go of the ledge. And fell into the abyss. Amazing. <laughs> Sir, if you could just please. Just please, sir. Just a little bit, a little bit. Talk to, talk to, a little bit. If you stand up into the. Keep holding my breath, it's got my breathing all fucked up. But I have my I have my misgivings. Mm, it's my nose. Last one. There we go. Okay. Now, open it. Open it. Open it. No, open the cannon. Talk to the. Get out of the water. No. You know what? Don't on. All right, now. No! Oh, thank God. 
Okay, okay. We're here. We're on the correct side of the island. We are on the broad platform. All we have to do is jump down on this side. Aha! Now we're following here. Yeah. At last. Victory. Look at this force perspective hallway. How gaudy is this? This is why we eat rich, y'all. Spending and spending all the money. Eaglers red coins. Pick the right size of Mario to be. You can't punch these ones, you gotta stand on them. That's cool. Because they be. They're too chonky. Come here. Come here. Come here. Sucker! Get dunked on. So something I don't remember if this happened in the Nintendo 64 version or if you know, it just wasn't rumble pack functionality with it because the rumble pack came out so much later after but the controller vibrates when you ride the shell no no um... Get away from the cool fish before he freaking eats us again. It's like Lord of the Rings? How, how's, how's that? They made people look little. Oh, uh, yeah, yeah. Alright. This time. No! Okay, okay. It's a sound concept. We just gotta, we just gotta finesse it. We gotta lab it. This is a fighting game, and we would lab it. Maybe we can still lab it, even though it's not a fighting game. Get up there! Don't fall off. Good. And now, careful, careful, careful. I did all this work to get up here, and now I'm like, don't want to go get the hundred coins first. <sighs> no, I'm stupid. At least now I know my my absolute guaranteed way to get up there. Just to shoot the cannon. Not a shower of coins. All right, bye. Enjoy the abyss. Get up there. Oh, 
And Sudden Wind is just... Is, mm -mm. It's extra game. We didn't need it. Out training. Too bad, you don't get a rematch. You've raced all we're gonna race. You lost twice, you're 0 2. I'm the champion for eternity. The red ones go faster. I'm sorry, I don't make the rules. Get your your diamond. Please don't throw me off this freaking cliff. What did I just say? No one ever no one's ever kind and respects my wishes. Oh that's on me. over there. Please, sir, thank you. Is this coins or is this... That's a star. It's not a thing. Alright, nothing up here. Get up my sleeves, nothing in my hands. What if you didn't do that, though? What if you quit falling off the mountain, Mario? Okay. Let's be a little stupid. And try to fall onto this island. Yes. Give me your coins. Just kick it under the chin and snap it back. Okay. And then I gotta change over to big and get. Someone else is home. Sigurd is going absolutely bananas. All right, so 56 plus 16 is 72. So I need 28 coins from the big half of the island. Sigurd, honey, what are you, what are you mad at? Tiny girl. What the heck? Where did it go? Did I grab it? I hope I grabbed it. Is anyone chat paying attention to see if I grabbed it?
please? Please? Thank you. So there's Koopa to click. We're going to murder him for his blue coin. You cannot escape me. Give me your money, loser. Also, our coins are currently super nice. It's about to be over, though. Jump on it? I know it's small, but... There you go. No. Yes. Bruh. Skirm it. Also, Skirm Mario. My viewers, you're supposed to view the thing. How very dare. Fired. What the heck? It died? Never seen that before. Oh god. Oh god. Oh, god. Crazy ass? Get over here. should be just enough. 8 times 2 is 16, is it not? 2, 4, 6, 18, 12, 16, yes. Okay, we're ready. Come small. You're on fire. You're the only one who ever shows up to these. Come back here. Magically stop. Might just be safe to go around the mountain the other way. Not get murked by giant balls. Dude, please. What's that? <sighs> it's really frustrating. Like, every time he would jump up there, like, he would not get up there if there was not a ball. Like, I don't understand what was the matter with it. Mm. 
bus driver. Come here. Changer. Mamma mia. Oh. If the name of the star was throw yourself in the hole, we've gotten it 20 times. Jumped on it with my fire butt and killed it that way. Why are you turning? Just go the direction I tell you to go. Come here. Don't go over there. The coin will probably fall down. I'm waiting on you to move. And it fell down. Body tackle me. If it hits me and explodes itself, it doesn't count. I don't get the coin. Jump on it, my guy. Mario. Mario. Firebutt is obscenely powerful. Yes. Get back up here like that, or back up there like this. 
Fireflowers over there. Without floating in the air. I guess it's fine. I hope I got them both. That time it was courteous. Why are they not here? Jeez, it takes so long for him to slow down. This side of the island, which means we should be able to drop down here and let Kylo Ren finish what we started. I need to go turn big. Don't get eaten by a fish. Please? So if I pound this steak down, what does it do? Okay. 
Nothing. Incredible. Are you joking? Any of what movies? Uh, the new Star Wars ones? So close. No! The what the fuck was that? It looked like the camera freaked out and everything. No, and not stay big. You in the back. How did you fall towards it? Shifting Sandland was bad. Yes, Gurdan. Jump out. Jump out. Jump out. So I thought they were all right. The second one was the best one to me. <laughs> People eat shit on it. It leaves me on the line. Laura Dern with purple hair. I suppose not. Uh. 
run up the mountain. Thank you so much. Get over here. Jump. Whoa. You can't get me. I really it's easy to tell when I'm frustrated because I just quit talking. I don't want to just leave it. Otherwise, it's going to be this terrible thing that I have to dread. And after this, um, eight red coins and 100 coin stars, just one softball boss fight, and then I'm finished with the. I'm finished with the painting. It really isn't much left to do. It's just this one part has been such an enormous pain in the butt. Like, it's not taking really that long to get everything. It's like I'm already at... Well, I'm about to be at 25 coins. So it's not, it's not like this is hard. Or that it's a lot of effort necessarily. It's just... I don't know. Like, it really... I know I said this the other day and it probably sounds like being a crybaby, but... I really feel like the controls for this are not as precise as they used to be. I don't remember this being this difficult by any stretch. And I also, like I said earlier, like a few people have corroborated this, so at least I know it's not just me. Stop! Fuck! Mamma mia! Mm. 
In the pipe, please. No, what the fuck? I tried to turn him towards the mountain, he jumps in the hole. That's how it feels. Like, I used to, could, like, just turn the stick and he would turn, and now he, at the time he wants to, I don't know. Amazing. Little dude just exploding. It's not the way. Like, I tried, like, there, I'm trying to get him to actually turn around and go up the stairs, and he's just cartwheeling all over creation. Like, I might go figure out a Mario 64 emulator. And then try it and see how it feels compared to this, because... Or even just see if our old Nintendo 64 with Mario 64 exists. And try to compare, because... I don't know, like... I believe it wasn't this hard to get him to go in the directions I wanted him to go. All I need is 84 coins. I'm trying to walk him into the thing and he wants to grab every ledge. Get in the water and grab the coin before it disappears. Got it, barely. Jesus.
God, I had more fun than this playing Sonic Colors with my nephews. I'm sitting here fighting this fucking thing as hard as I can go, and then there's people who beat this game with blindfolds on. Of course, none of them are playing on this, they're using emulators. But I paid $60 for this shit, I swear to god, never again. What the fuck?! Why does he keep exploding against... Uh. No, it just... but I don't really want to. Like, at this point, I'm so entrenched in it. I, I really just want to finish it. Like, I don't want to have to go and play a different stage, or in stream go play a different game, or do something, and then have to think that next time I get on this, I, this is what I have to do. Fucking turn the other way! Look how weird he's jumping. Like, I'm trying to get him to, like, if I'm making him jump this way, I want him to turn and jump that way? But then he's just jumping backward. Like, get the fuck out of here with that. Like, that's not at all the thing you should be doing. Okay, I kicked it four times. I don't... Fucking, uh...
I was just trying to hit the wall. I was right there. And then got... Got knocked off the freaking course. And then have not been that close ever since. Fucking long jump, you piece of shit. What was all of that? Just... And turn towards the wall. I don't know why every slope makes him slide like a freaking crazy person. I kind of feel like if a Goomba sh can walk on it, I should be able to walk on it. Look at this little fucker. He's just out there. There's no way in hell I could get anywhere near him. Come here. I don't know what made the difference that time that he didn't grab the ledge. So I get up there and kill that little goomba. It's too much to ask, I guess. here. And he's, uh... Just let me get out of the water safely. Get up here after this little fucking Goomba. I have no idea what that noise was. Yeah. <laughs> 
Oh my god. Okay, back to small side. Or not, I don't care anymore. Jesus, get out of the way. How in the fuck? Every time! And now I'm gonna get hit with fire because I can't line up the fucking jump! I swear to god, I don't remember that fire-breathing little shithead being there. I don't know where that giant cannonball thing came from just now. Like, I... I'm so confused. Amazing. I would wonder if maybe I'm too grouchy to be doing this shit, but there's people with literally a thousand times my viewer count right now, getting even more upset than this, and maintaining all their people. You want to turn around, fucker? Doesn't matter. He just threw himself off the ledge. I literally don't know what that is or where it comes from or why. I cannot recall that even one time back in the 90s. 
Fucking why? That's not the thing I told you to do. He should have thrown himself off the goddamn cliff face this time. Stupid idiot! Why do you want to kill yourself? What the fuck? I jumped on it! Which is good. Whatever. If he would just turn in the correct directions or not, throw himself off of ledges. Whoa! 
Remember the last time you got hit in the back and you fell over backward off the fucking cliff? I remember that. So why'd you fall forward this time? Jeez, I landed on it and it didn't give me a coin. You! Mamma mia! Let's go! believe in turning around and running the other way. So what's the matter? Now it works. That's cool. There's no way I can get up there before it it fades. And that's the end of that. Amazing. Let's go. 
Amazing. You wanna grab the coins before they go away? Stupid fuck. This might change the game. What in the absolute fuck? At least one of us is having fun. Fuck you, idiot! What the hell? Blue coin if you ground pound them. Okay. Alright, done. Easy. You get a blue coin which is more valuable if you can kill the giant Goombas with a ground pound. Which is gonna make this way easier. To the point where I may not even have to fuck with being big at all. At least only in certain places. So much better than what I've been putting up with. Yeah. 
Over here, over here, stupid. Jump up there? Look at this. Halfway there. It's taken hardly any time at all. As long as he lands inside the island, I don't care. Get up there, you stupid idiot. How did you throw yourself backward? Whatever, I'm not gonna question. Alright. Um, 16 left, we'll do it. Please don't get eaten by the cool fish, Mario. It was, like, so back on the Nintendo 64, it was. Like, I swear to God, dude, I did not have half this issue with the game back in the 90s. I don't know what's different, like, I couldn't begin to put my finger on it and explain it to you, but something is, there's something different and weird about this version of the game. Because when it lists this, it says 1996 and 1997, which is suspect to me, in any case. So, 
back back in the 90s when we first played it yeah we were really like it was a new kind of thing it was weird to control we didn't really understand it but later like it got it got better my main problem with this seems to be that controlling mario himself is hyper inaccurate compared to how it felt Like, it used to be, like, like I could hit the stick left-right, and he would execute his cartwheel. In this, I feel like there's, like, an 80% chance he's just gonna turn around in place, like, spinning himself and not doing the kickflip or doing the side wheel at all. And so it's been, like, see here? Like, I'm, like, there, I tried to do it, he turned up. That, I swear that never happened, and it, it's little bullshit like that that has been driving me up the wall for this whole playthrough. Like, it, I swear it was never ever like this. Like, it's, like it was the first 3D Mario so for a lot of people, it being the first one gives it added value. And I would never st uh, at least I got the fucking 100 point star. It's actually easier if I go in from the small side. Yeah, you could be right about that, but I don't know, man. Like, it it feels off. I might Google later and see if I'm if I'm imagining it or if there's something to it. But uh, I'm not the only one who feels like this is really weird and jank compared to how it was. Like a bunch of people who played it before, are like, what the fuck is wrong with this version? Like, I played them, I don't think you were in the chat when I said this before, um, uh, pardon me, uh, MDH, I don't think you were here when I said it earlier. I played them in the reverse order of their release, because I felt like they can, I feel like this one controlled better than the other two. Like, Mario has more movement options in this, he's got different ways to jump. Uh, it just it feels overall better control Mario in this because of he does have all these different movement options compared to Sunshine where they took a bunch of them out to make room for Flood and compared to and then especially compared to Galaxy where he has almost no jump options to speak of. Like, and, and that, a bunch of them are actually legitimately difficult, though, is the thing. Like, because especially, like, NES, SNES, Sega Genesis era stuff, like, developers still had the mindset of, like, an arcade. Where, if they're going to get quarters out of you, they have to make it super tough so you spend more money on it. Now that's not necessarily- oh look, it's a blue switch. That would have saved me a lot of issue too if I had known it was here. But yeah, like a lot of it was legitimately difficult. Like really difficult. Like to the point where there's like a whole ass- For those of you who have ever visited tvtropes.org, there's a, a, a Nintendo hard trope that describes these games being like heinously difficult for almost no reason. Yeah, that's exactly what I'm saying. Like, like older, like older games of that era, especially. It did. It did. Actually, that's probably why I feel like it was more precise executing the left to right because, because of the way it was. Yeah, yeah. So that's what I'm saying when I when I'm talking about uh, being Nintendo hard. That's what I mean. Like, that's- that's it. Like, you experienced it. 
because they were in they were still developing from a mindset of we need to get their quarters out of them so we're going to make it ridiculous and make them go to all manner of lengths to keep dropping quarters and try to finish the game and like practice the shit out of it and really get good at it like conti like continues and lives were like were what stood in for like your your coin credits on the home console but like i think about being a kid and playing Nintendo 64 and like this game was baller shit and i don't I don't know if I'm just older now, and so I stink now, or if it's a if it's a port with a controller issue, or what. Like any of the different things we've been saying, but it feel it feels off. It's not quite the same game I've been trying to play. It's like my brother, uh, my older brother, said he bought it so his son, he and his sons could play this and enjoy it like they did. And he said it was different from how he remembered and not in a good way. And the boys were just kind of frustrated with it. Like, why is this good? Like, And some stuff I have been able to do just as easily and it's been it's not all been focused in the earlier stages where you would expect an easier difficulty either like I blew up the free the freaking Bowser in the sea or whatever was that water stage before I fought the second Bowser and then I didn't have too hard of a time with the wet dry world either then you fly to my house and look at this mess what I'm gonna do everything's ruined and make me mad the star make me feel shy and strange. Anyway, this dude's having a temper tantrum because I bombed out his house with water. Anyway, he's not even hard to defeat. You just jump on him three times. Like, he gets moderately faster each time. Yeah, you made me mad, man! Like... I jumped at him too soon. Anyway. Just freaking die. Look at that. I, I killed him in my hit reaction. And it was starting off out of that. Anyway. I don't care. He's just saying he feels better because he ain't got no star. He likes little stars. It makes him feel peaceful. Anyway. That's why I put myself through all that nonsense. Honestly, if I would have known or remembered, because maybe I just straight forgot that if you if you uh, ground pound, if you do this to kill the big Goombas. This one is a painting. This is actually one of my favorites in the whole game. It's got a big star. And that star slide. It also has a big star too though. We'll do the big slide. To make me happy. And then we'll finish out this stage. Another time. The monkey will steal your hat, just so we're clear. You know what, I'll take it. Somewhere here... There is a place on the wall.
Oh yeah, this is where this uh, that cliff face comes up at. There's a shimmering stone wall like a painting. That's where we want to go. Please. I hear you, monkey. That's not it. It's that one. For the 100 coin star, you have to do the slide first. Oh shit, am I gonna land on the slide? Nope. Let's see if it starts me in the slide or not. Yes. So yeah, you have to start here if you want to do the 100 coins. There's a lot of coins on this uh, on the slide. If you get the star on the slide, you have to you have to also collect it from the slide, which can be difficult. Generally, what you'll want to do is wait until it tells you to get the eight red coins. Collect everything up to at least 16 coins, and then call it good. And then... Yeah, that's that's the start of the level down there. So you just hop off the this corner, and go back to your collection. Alright, that's gonna do it. We'll go lower my heart rate. Next time we'll start from here. Uh, here, let's come out here and save myself some copyright striking music. Thank you, Boonanners and MD, being ever present. Thank you, Lost Play, for the new follow. If anyone is out there,